So here it is. First of all, I know the video is in portrait mode and not landscape mode, but this thing is so tall. <laughs> I felt like the only way to get a good shot was to film this way. So you are taking a look at the official Helm of Domination from BlizzCon. Uh, it was a limited edition item. It sold out very, very quickly. And I got mine in the mail today and I have just been obsessing over the worksmanship and the overall build quality of this thing for the last couple hours. And I just cannot get enough of how beautiful it is. The attention to detail on everything is just absolutely through the roof. It is so, so, so gorgeous. Uh, unfortunately, you can't wear it. Um, and there is a really basic base that if you're looking at it dead on, you see the pole and it's kind of like, ah. So I think you gotta kind of display it like this and then it pretty much entirely hides it. Uh, but it is way too small to, um, to put on, unfortunately. You're not gonna be able to wear this or anything like that. Let's go ahead and take a look at this side. I mean, it is just a mirror image, basically, of the other side, but every little attention to detail. I, I went back and I looked at the uh, video, the Fall of Arthas video. You get a really, really good look at the Helm of Domination when it is placed upon Bolvar's head, and it looks just like this. I mean, obviously, you know, them being Blizzard, having the access to their own files, they were able to, you know, basically print this exactly one-to-one -one and um, they didn't miss any details at all. So what I really like about it is just, it's such a distinct piece. Um, if you're a fan of, you know, World of Warcraft or of just Warcraft in general, you know, Warcraft 3, really where you get to see Arthas' story. Um, just such an interesting story that he went through. Such an interesting tale that Arthas, you know, went on to unfortunately become the Lich King. And um, what, I, what I love so much about this helmet, so iconic, just a very, very distinct look. Um, you know, there's a lot of games, a lot of medieval games that have different types of armor and different types of armor sets, but nothing as unique and as vibrant as, in my opinion, the helm. This absolutely makes me want to get uh, Frostmourne now. I feel like Frostmourne's next. I feel like I gotta find a way to own um, that sword to complete the set because I do have up here, uh, when my wife and I went to BlizzCon in 20, I think 2009, 2010, uh, we paid extra to go to this like fundraiser charity auction and they gave out these really cool uh, prints. Uh, there it is, 2009. There's right there. From uh, Paul Y. And there's Sindragosa, which is, you know, as Arthas is basically one of his, you know, trusty sidekicks um, on top of his horse as well. He's got his horse, but invincible. But um, yeah, this helmet just, I just feel like this helmet with like Frostmourne behind it, I would just lose my mind. But yep, I just want to do some high quality zoom ins here. Just so you can see everything, all the attention to detail. And uh, yeah, they didn't screw up on the base. The base is very basic. You know, I, I hate helmets that have just really like gaudy bases. This is just very basic. It snaps right into the back of the helmet. I don't really think you'd want to display the helmet without the base because it wouldn't sit right. Um, it would lean back and um, I don't think it'd look as menacing because it'd just be kind of tilting up in the air. But when I put this where it's pretty much its final resting place on my standing desk, just like this, man oh man does that pop and I absolutely love this. So just wanted to give you guys a quick, uh, quick look over of the old Helm of Domination and to tell you guys that I am incredibly happy this thing was not cheap and i'm okay with that um <laughs> because it looks so good I, I you know a lot of times i get these i get these things and they just they don't have the attention to detail even like the skull all the little teeth and nostrils it's all so finely done and it's not really being accentuated so much by the camera it's just that's the way they made it just world-class product a for effort a for execution i'm in love Hope you guys enjoyed this quick look at the Helm of Domination. 
And uh, that's it for today's video. So I will talk to you later. Take care. And until next time, we'll see you guys on the other side.